Well, it's finally here. What's going on, everyone? Might go back, doing another box break. The date of today's box break recording is April 1st, 2023. I am breaking the just released 2021 Bowman Heritage Baseball. Absolutely crazy. A product that was supposed to come out several years ago has finally been released by Topps. They made it available exclusively on tops.com and in a bundle, 2021 and 2022 Bowman Heritage Baseball. The 2019 and 2020 Bowman Heritage products were fairly popular overall. You got a lot of rookies, you got a lot of prospects, autographs, chrome parallels, all sorts of stuff, image variations. So we'll see what 2021 Bowman Heritage has to offer. Should be fun. Heritage products are neat throwback products. You can see the old school, really nice Bowman design. So this hobby box features 10 cards per pack, 24 packs per box, one autograph per box, redemptions. So if there's any expired redemptions, I would hope and fully expect Tops to accept <laughs> them because, you know, the product was just released. Anyway, we're going to break this box and see how we do. Of course, the 2021 rookie class is not the strongest out there. You know, there's some really good players from that class, of course, but they have not become hobby darlings for various reasons. Some guys just haven't performed. Other guys have performed, but they just have so much stuff out there. So many people paid overwhelming prices for them, got so much stuff graded that they just aren't considered super highly collectible at the moment by certain people. Anyway, let's see how we do in this box. A lot of prospects as well. You get two Chrome Prospect cards in every pack. Here's a look at the odds if you want to pause. Black and white parallels, 1 in 3. Image variations, 1 in 12. Chrome Prospect parallels, you have all sorts of refractors printing plates and such. So we should get two image variants in the box. Hopefully they'll be upside down or backwards or something like that. Let's get into pack number one. And our first card is Robert. Nice looking card. Really clean looking Bowman design. Alexander Ramirez of the Mets. Edward Cabrera. Riley Green. Nice card there, but guy who's now a rookie chase in 2023. Andres Jimenez with Cleveland. He's a really good player. Soderstrom. We've got a Jake Etter. And that is going to be a Chrome. And a refractor of Bryce Terang, number to 199. Sam Huff, rookie, and George Springer. Now we'll get into the next pack. Cattell Marte, Pedro Leon, a Bobby Miller, Jazz Jr., rookie. Nolan Gorman, prospect card, Brady Singer. Russians. Miguel Blyce, Chrome Parallel. And a Byron Laura Chrome. Austin Wells. I like very mildly glanced at the checklist at some point, so I'm not completely familiar. I don't know if they re uh, numbered things. There's Christian Pache, rookie. He has since been moved a few times. He went to Oakland last year and struggled, and he actually just made his Phillies debut today as a pinch hitter in a blowout in the bottom of the ninth. So doesn't look like he's going to have a great career, but you never know. There's a black and white parallel of Jake Cronenworth. He actually just signed a seven-year extension with the San Diego Padres today. So he's a... He's a really good player. Jake Vogel. 
and Cavaco for the Twins. Perdomo and Austin Martin. So Austin Martin is a twin. When was he traded? I guess he was traded in 2021. Christian Javier, rookie, fabulous player, does not get Hobby Love, Ali Rutschman prospect card, Mayo, Emmanuel Rodriguez, Chrome, and Vizcaino, Eduardo Garcia. I'm going to make the majority of singles in this box available over my eBay shop. Link down below. Isbell. Jordan Walker, he's getting a lot of attention with his debut. Mercedes, Ronnie Mauricio, McClellahan. We got a Kim. I'm guessing that's a uh, perhaps an image variation because it was upside down, 938. Yeah, I think that's an image variation there. We've got a Vargas Chrome and then a gold refractor of Cade Cavelli of Washington. So a gold to 50. Cody Bellinger and Miguel Cabrera. Clark Schmidt. Marco Luciano, Daniel Lynch, Blaze Jordan, Nolan Arenado, Jaron Duran. That's a nice one. Black and white parallel of Julio Rodriguez. Heck of a prospect. We'll see if he makes an impact in the majors. Obviously, he's been become really the face of uh, the rookie chase from last year. Julio Rodriguez, black and white parallel. So... Two pretty good black and whites. Jose Salas Chrome and Drew Waters. Kevin Alcantara Base. All right, we get two more before we hit the one third mark. Deshaun Knowles, Dane Dunning, CJ Abrams. There's a Bryce Harper Base card. Little off center, unfortunately. Brennan Davis Chrome. And a Chrome of Marcus Smith, Tristan Casas, and Nick Madrigal. Blaise Bonailer, Javier Baez is a Met, Urbina, Bay. Torres, Jordan Adams, Blaze, Jordan Chrome. Looks like we got a blue refractor coming up. And it is Riley Green. Unfortunately, pretty severely off center left to right, but still a nice one to get. Riley Green, serial numbered out of 99. And Mojica. So a third of the way through the box, doing pretty well. Still looking for an autograph. I'm assuming the autograph checklist is pretty large. So, of course, as always, tough to get one of the ones that you would uh, want the most. But you never know. Cruz, Mena, Kyle Lewis. He's uh, playing pretty well for Arizona to this point. Dalton Varsho, Langliers. Got an Andrew Vaughn. I'm sure it's a another image variation. Andrew Vaughn rookie. Big uh, go-ahead hit in the opener for the White Sox. There's a Hunter Green Chrome pitching pretty well for the Reds. Bobby Miller Chrome. Cabrian Hayes rookie. Patrick Bailey. It's nice to see some of these prospects that are in this product, you know, making a name for themselves in the big leagues. Jeter Downs, Mackenzie Gore, Debbie Garcia. Spencer Howard, Tarang, Carreras. There's a Jared Kelly, black and white. Chrome, Amador. So only one Chrome in that pack. Supposed to get two per pack, but not the case in that one. Bo 
Bobby Witt Jr. is a really nice looking Bobby Witt Jr. Jonathan India rookie. Jason Dominguez. Nolan Jones. Bobby Dahlback rookie. Francisco Alvarez. A chrome Zach Veen. We got a Trent Devereaux chrome. And we got a refractor number to 199 of Xavier Edwards of Tampa Bay. Arias and Garrett. So you're getting a little, little shine, some color, some shine. Obviously chromes in every pack. A few black and whites, some rookies, some prospect cards. I like the product. I like the look of the product to this point. Joe Adele rookie, J.J. Blade, Randy Arozarena, Chromes of Hendrick and Shamaki, Sabato for Minnesota. Christian Hernandez, Espanol, Brennan Davis, Antonio Gomez, Jacob deGrom, Black and white, Luis Garcia of the Nats. Chrome of Woods Richardson. Sixto Sanchez rookie, Miguel Amaya. Andrew Vaughn. So that's an Andrew Vaughn base. And I had the SP earlier. Bruhan Molina. Pyron, Salas, Jose Ramirez, Polanco, Pineda Chrome. There's our autograph, and our autograph is Piguero of the Pittsburgh Pirates. I know he did make his Major League debut last year, so he has rookie cards in 2023. Badu rookie. Nice looking auto on card. I'm sure we could have done worse with the autograph. Certainly, I'm sure could have done better as well, but it's always kind of a win in Bowman products when you at least get a position player. There's a Spencer Torkelson, Joey Gallo, Cespedes, Johan Rojas, Chrome of Minna, and Westberg. Garrett Mitchell, Jerry Kellenick rookie. He uh, had a very good spring training, getting a chance with the Mariners to start the season. Hopefully he will uh, contribute and kind of be able to consistently hit a little bit. There's a nice JT Real Muto base card. Drew Waters, Paul Goldschmidt, black and white of Austin Meadows. Pedro Leon Chrome and Bonacci Chrome. Emerson Hancock Prospect. We are two thirds of the way through the box. Already hit the autos, probably hit the color. Maybe we have a chance for another refractor. Already hit the two image variations Joey Votto, Alec Thomas, Shane Bieber. Scooble, Espinal, Pete Crow, Edwards, and Kim. Looks like we got a either gold or yellow. A few years ago, they made gold and yellow, and they looked very similar. I don't know if that's the case. Anthony Volpe. That'll be a popular card. Shohei Otani. Santana. Terang Chrome. And I believe that's a yellow number to 75. Tyler Soderstrom of Oakland. There's a nice Julio Rodriguez base. A few more packs. Royce Lewis, Whit Merrifield, 
Beltre, Gunnar Henderson, Alex Kirilov, Hassel, Anthony Volpe, Chrome Parallel. Another Chrome, it's Hernandez from Tampa, Luis Garcia, and Cade Cavalli. like the look of the pack packaging as well. Jose Rodriguez, Pete Alonzo, Aguilar, Josh Jung, Tristan McKenzie, rookie, De La Rosa, Black and White Cavalli, Chrome Diaz and Beltre, Tyler Stevenson, rookie, Juan Soto, back in the day when he played for the Nats. Camposano, Joey Bart, Hunter Green, Acosta, Mackenzie Gore, Chrome. And we got Nova. Got a Brandon Marsh. Lacey Manoa. Pawson, Corbin Carroll. I mean, a lot of these guys have reached the majors already. Dingler, U Darvish, Jeter Downs. These are a refractor of JJ Blade, number to 199. Viz Cayeno. All right, last two packs coming up. William Contreras, Mike Trout, Zach Veen. Albert Pujols, Acosta, Jeremy Pena, black and white. That's a good black and white. J.J. Blade, Chrome. D.L. Hall, Chrome. Another guy who's made the majors. Hall, Base. Jordan Alvarez. All right, last pack. Final pack of this box of 2021 Bowman Heritage Baseball. Valdez, Nova, Donaldson, Johnson, Lindor, Foscu, Mick Abel, Chrome, Brett Beatty, Chrome, Colmenez, and Carson Tucker. So that's a look at 2021 Bowman Heritage Baseball. Took a while to be released. A couple years, in fact. But I thought it was a fun rip for sure. And kind of interesting seeing all these prospects who have now made the majors. So you get a solid amount of base cards. I mean, you get 240 total cards. Obviously, you get parallels and such, but there's a look at the base. You got some black and whites, which did pretty well on overall. A couple image variations. Vaughn and Kim. Solid stack of chrome. Which I don't know, the chrome look neat, but I actually like probably the base cards a little better. Hit one autograph, Pagero for the Pirates, and then our refractors and color parallels. Did solid in those as well. So comment below, let me know what you think of 2021 Bowman Heritage Baseball. You're gonna rip any, you're gonna buy some singles, you're just interested in it. What do you think about the two year wait? Do you think they should have just scrapped it and trashed it? Or are you happy they released it? To me, there's no reason not to release it at this point. What the holdup was, who knows, but it's here finally. Check out the channel. Appreciate you guys. Comment below. Let me know what you think. And I will be breaking some 2022 Bowman Heritage Baseball next. Tune in for that one. Have a great one.